<laughs> What's up, y'all? It's Justin, Brooke, Molly, and Tyler, and we're back at it again. Today, we're going to be telling you guys that one thing that we wish that we would have known before coming to Highlands College. But before we get started, we got a little challenge, okay, guys? Oh, right. We're going to be nice. trying to tell our Highlands College story oh, in one minute. One minute. Mm -hmm. One minute, not two, not three, but one minute, Man. okay? Justin's gonna. Hey, I think. You can I, do it. Well, gonna I think I can do it. I mean, really? it's gonna be tough. I don't know, bro. It's gonna be tough. I don't know, bro. It's gonna be a little know? tough. Tyler, you I'll first? first. Yeah. Okay, Tyler, you wait, first. so in a minute to go. A minute. You okay. got a minute. Okay. Brooke, okay. show him the I'm timer. Show him the timer. Ready, set, go. Okay, so um, I'm a pastor's kid. So growing up, okay. I was in church okay. every Sunday, every Monday, every, literally all the time. All the time. I was like, on staff in middle school. Right? <laughs> but, oh and so gosh. getting to that point, it got to the point where like, church became like very like, just out of habit. And yeah. so yeah. it wasn't like genuine. And I kind of fell out of love with church. And so I actually wanted to go to UNG and be a physical therapist. Yeah. I didn't want to go into ministry. What? And I can't tell the whole story, but I got called to ministry through a Zaxby's like, drive-thru. Zaxby's drive Zaxby's. Zaxby's. I went to Zaxby's. That's why he loves Zaxby's. 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 I got called, to, I got called to ministry through a Zaxby's drive-thru. And then I was like, okay, God, where do you want me to go? And my brother actually came to HC, and he's like, bro, you got to come to a preview day? And I was like, okay, I'll go to a preview day. And after that, I was hooked, and here I am now. So, yeah. Wow, 10 seconds to wow. spare. Man, he he really real did deal. that. He did it. He's the real deal. Oh, my Molly. gosh. Molly, okay. Okay. you ready? <laughs> okay, ready, set, go. So I also grew up in church. My parents were on staff, so not a PK, but a staff kid. Yeah. And I grew up in church all my life, saw my parents do ministry, and I pretty much always knew that that's what I wanted to do. So it wasn't a struggle for me to say yes to ministry, but it was more of a struggle for me to find like where to go. Because yeah, really. like I didn't know ministry schools really existed. Right. Um, but I came across Church of the Highlands podcasts and I started listening wow. to PC's <laughs> message and I stalked them on Instagram <laughs> and then I found Highlands College yeah. and I came to a preview day. If you want to come, you should come. Highlands College. Highlands College. Yeah, shout out shout out visit. <laughs> um, and I fell in love and I said yes. Come so on. here we are. Everyone's uh, leaving a little time, 52 Ooh. seconds. Oh, me and you, me, me. You got it. Okay, got it. okay, okay. 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 Oh, All right, okay. ready? Run, he... I talk a lot. Justin, ready, set, go. Okay, so I also grew up in church my whole life. Big uh, church kid. My parents were praise and worship leaders, but I was the kid that always said, there's no way I'm going to Bible college. Right. Like, I'm not doing ministry. I played football all throughout high school. I actually signed to go play football my senior year yeah. on a scholarship and everything. And literally two weeks before I was supposed to go to fall camp, I was in Brazil on a missions trip and God called me in Brazil through what? a random Brazilian I, that <laughs> I never name? met. I, I still don't know his name. I don't know that. He got a How translator. I've, never heard, <laughs> I've literally never heard that. Before. Literally, he got a translator, <laughs> came to me, it. told me that God was calling me to something bigger, that I would have to lay down wow. something I love, That's which crazy. was football. I came back, told my parents, laid it down. Six months later, I was in Highlands College, and now I'm here. Wow. So there it's honestly go. pretty crazy. Look at 52 God. seconds. Oh, oh, look at God. 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 I got you. I got you. Ready? Three. Oh, wait. OK, I got it. I got it. Three, two, one. All right, Go. so my story is a little bit different than theirs. I didn't really get involved with church until I was about 18 years old. I'm 22 now. A lot of time has passed. In the in-between of 18 and before I came to Highlands College, I knew I wanted to go to a ministry school, didn't know what, but I was in a worship service at, one of, at my home church one day and I felt the Lord say the word Highlands, wrote it down in my journal, just forgot about it, don't think what? of that word too often. And so I went home and I typed in Highlands Ministry School and Highlands College was the oh first thing that popped up. I had never heard of Pastor Chris or Church of the Highlands before. And I ended up coming to a preview day and just 
falling it's in really love with it. It's really a preview day. Really? Yes, yes. happy oh, day. You, you got, got a preview go. day. Come to you a preview go. day. I truly totally had never felt peace like I had in that moment. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And that's it. Now I'm here. So guys, that challenge was so much fun. I love that challenge. And really the point of this video is that us as upperclassmen, we've been here two years, Crazy. like one year and a half as a third semester, but we just want to leave you with one thing we wish we would have known before coming to Highlands College because just a little insight. Yeah. That's really it. And this would have been really nice to know. I think we all have different perspectives yeah. Yeah. and how For we sure. came into Highlands College. So For sure. who wants to go first? Justin? I guess so. You got I, guess, I guess I am going to. <laughs> um, yeah, so one thing I wish I would have known before coming to Highlands College is how to manage my time. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Man, how to manage my time. <laughs> That'll get you. That'll get you right off the bat. Because, I mean, in high school, everything is laid out for you. Yeah. Um, I knew when I had to do my homework and when I had to go to Study work hall. and yeah. like all that stuff. Yeah. And then you get to college and you just have so much free time. Right. Yeah. Like we say we're always busy, but I'm telling y'all, we have so much free time and it's but what funny. what you do with your free time. Yeah. Yes. yes. It's, it's like what difference. you do with it matters so much. Yeah. Because I mean, we found ourselves, man, up till one o'clock in the morning playing Monopoly. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Monopoly. Like, real talk. No, real talk. For a, a solid week, we played every night I know, I heard. So Three or four much. hours. We had a group I chat. Yeah. Yeah. So it was much crazy. Monopoly. Put me in a group chat. <laughs> but but like, we've had classes about time management. Literally. Yeah. And that's the great thing that we have leaders teaching us. Like, hey, yeah. make sure you get a planner. Make sure you yeah, write stuff down. Like, make sure you understand when you have to do stuff so you're not getting behind. And yeah. that's something that I kind of had to learn as I was going along. So I really wish that I would have known that before coming into Hollis College. So if yeah. you can right now, Start to plan your days out. Yeah. Like at the Full beginning of the week, just Google just Google even Google. even if you know that Google your week's Calendar. not that busy, like, like still write out your week yeah, just to get into the habit habits. of it just and yeah. everything like that. But yeah, that's one thing I wish I would have known. Yeah. Molly, what about you? So mine's a little more di <laughs> obviously a little more different. Yeah. yeah. I mine was kind of beforehand. I was so nervous about not making friends. Yeah. Yeah. Because I mean, I saw on the Instagram the whole HC family or like all these pictures of people together. And I was like, okay, well, how did how did they become friends? I don't yeah. know. Like, yeah. I had such great friends at home. So coming here too, I didn't know anybody. Did y'all know no. people coming? Ooh. Mm -hmm. I, know oh, I knew my I knew my brother. Yeah. And yeah. and my brother's roommate. <laughs> yep. That's yeah. yeah. But you're gonna come here and you're not gonna know a soul, and then that's terrifying. And I truly did not believe that I'd make friends, but. We're put in so many different settings, like sports and workouts. Yeah. Like we're in so many different groups to where you meet pretty much everybody. Yeah. yeah. And I actually did make solid friends. Like yeah. everyone's my friend basically. <laughs> yeah, and right. then you have your core group. But yeah. I just wish I would have known like, don't freak <clears throat> out. You might be lonely for like a day or two. But, like, Maybe a day. Maybe a day. Not Maybe even a day. Because <laughs> orientation day, that's where you meet yeah. like all and your yeah. friends. And we usually have a, a student life event to kick off the year yeah. Yeah. to create community and meet people. Because they yeah. know most of us are coming here from your everywhere. Oh, yeah, practicum. Big student prep. Student prep, baby. PL prep. PL prep. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, yeah. Prep. I, <laughs> I just wish I would have known that I was actually going to make friends. Right. So. Yeah. Yeah. What about um, you, Tyler? I would say like, so you have two years at HC. Mm -hmm. I say look at the perspective of not like, man, I have two years, but like, no, I have two years. Two <laughs> years. Like you think you think when you get here, like, man, like this is a whole different thing. No. You step your foot in and you're you're <laughs> leaving yeah, yeah, yeah. like as soon as you get here. Like yeah. the fat so the, the quickest two years of my life. By Straight far. up. Yeah. And so just making sure like like Justin said with time management, like like you may not see it in the moment, but be intentional about what you're spending your time yeah. doing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So because you only have two years, yeah. and so that's what also things like opportunities to serve, mm -hmm. um, like say, maybe saying yes or no to certain things. Like uh, just yeah. make sure like it's not a, a laid back two years, but like no, I have a two year gap. Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna, gonna learn, yeah. grow, learn, yeah. grow, do everything I can yeah. 
yeah. in that two years. It's almost like an urgency kind of thing. Like, yeah. like, let's get it done. Because when so you much. walk out of here, man, like you want to say, yeah. yeah, you want to say, I got it all. <laughs> yeah, I got it all, and now I'm equipped yes. to go out and do ministry. Because yeah. like that is the vision of the college. Yeah. It's not yeah. that we stay, but, but that we go. Yeah. So just making sure you get everything out of yeah. it. Yeah. So it's not just oh, two years, but it's no, you got two years. Yeah. So get re good relationships, good leaders. Yeah. Um. Girl close with the Lord. It's it's so important. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that's what that's what I would say. That's great. Yeah. That's great, Brooke. And one thing I wish I would have known before coming to Highlands College is, like Molly was saying, you're gonna hear HC family all the time, and you may think it's cheesy, but I promise I you <laughs> that I've truly never been in a place where I can walk into any staff members, any professor, anybody here basically into their office into their home mm -hmm. and just be myself and yeah, ask yeah. questions yeah, that's and right. no one has ever made me feel yeah. um like what my question was was invalid yeah, yeah. they yeah. sat there with me and they explained we have the best professors here. Hands yeah down. love chris Anna. i had so many questions because i didn't sure, come to my faith until later in life but that's okay god sees yeah. you he meets you where you're at and we are equipped so well with the yeah. best leaders yeah. here and yeah. i'm so thankful for literally everyone literally. Yeah. so it, it truly is hc family it's really hc family and it'll become real to you yeah no, yeah yeah, yeah. to you right off the bat mm -hmm. right great. and we want you guys to be a part of that hc family like hey. come on come be a come part to come HC. to a preview day come, hey preview, preview day, day. Preview day. Uh, we love it's, them they're amazing. We're not just hyping it up. Like, no, our yeah, lives have changed. No, yeah. yeah. All four of us went to a preview just day. Just sign up. That's why we're here. We'll sign say up. the link again. HighlandsCollege.com <laughs> slash visit. <laughs> and, be and do it. Like, do <laughs> it. Why not? Yeah. Tell okay, us if you enjoy these videos, what? if you enjoy these videos, enjoy what should you do? I do. I would say you should subscribe. What? Subscribe. Comment. Comment. Like it. Like it. And stay tuned. Turn notifications on. Get them on. Yep. We post <laughs> Pop up. almost the, on Ding. the weekly. Next Tuesday, we'll see you guys oh back God. here. <laughs> Mucho love, love to all of you guys. Deuces.